and they're really known in the business for having really cute, well-designed, good quality miniature figures. And uh, they used to have this, there was a huge boom for these about five years ago. And a lot of the things that are part of those series are like really super hard to get a hold of anymore because they're not made. And I just noticed recently that they kind of started again and they're making all these character ones now. Uh, they have a whole bunch that are made with Sanrio characters like Hello Kitty, My Melody, and then uh, Ridakuma and also some Disney things too. So lots of fun stuff to look forward to. I thought the sushi one was adorable and I think it's super cute because even if you just collect all this, it combines together to make this cute little uh, counter for the sushi place, which is adorable. So... Um, these run about $3.99 at a convenience store, and uh, which is about $4, you know, if the yen rate was more like $100 to, I mean, 100 yen to a dollar, but it's not. Um, you don't know what you're buying, though, when you get this. You know that there's four, five, six pieces to this set, but they don't say anywhere on here what's inside. Um, sometimes with the, you know, kits like this that are more for kids, they'll tell you just straight out right here which one's inside so that you don't have a disappointed little child who's crying because they didn't get the one they wanted. Uh, but this stuff, you know, you really got to just try your luck and see if you get the thing that you want. Um, so a nice way to buy this is to just get stuff from online from places like Amazon and Lockten. They have a lot of people who open it. Of course, it's opened. You can't get it unopened. It's open and then you know what you're getting you get the full set um, and the price is about the same as the price just at the store now I was able to find these for just a little bit cheaper about 50 cents cheaper um, at a discount drugstore and I thought I'd try to see if I could be lucky and get them all I didn't um, I don't have the first one with Hello Kitty in it so I'm still hunting that down but this is an older one and I might not be able to get a hold of it we'll have to see I have had no luck so far these are completely sold out everywhere I've looked at online um, Unless I go and buy the whole set. I don't want to have to buy them all again. So we'll have to see. <laughs> but so uh, we've been going through all these. We've already gone through number two, three, four, and five. And today I'm going to show you this last one here. So we'll go ahead and open it up. I usually always open up my stuff from the bottom because I don't want to destroy any of the design and artwork on top of my boxes, but that's just a press preference. So open up down here from the bottom. And the night, the silly thing about these kits is they all have a little piece of gum. Either usually these things have gum or like laminate kind of candy in there. Uh, so this one has gum. Yay. Uh, so we'll put that to the side. And then inside is a whole big thing here of plastic. And it's got all the pieces in it. We've got this nice little tray, some chopsticks, and uh, Temaki sushi and some other sushis here and the little tiny thing for soy sauce which is cute so we're going to open that up but first there's one last little thing inside the box here this is a little booklet that discusses what's inside and there's a picture of the kit as you see it with everything and as you can tell, this is sort of like a uh, single serving platter of sushi that you might get at one of these sushi restaurants. Usually a lot of times there's the sushi that goes around and around in the circle. And then you can also order from a menu too, if you prefer. Uh, and sometimes, you know, they come on this cute little platter. Or these might even have lids and then they're like sushi bentos. So inside shows how everything looks from this kit. And you'll notice that here... The only thing that's shown here that's from this kit is this, the little chopsticks. Everything else is not shown uh, because it's sort of this individual thing. It doesn't really go on this counterpart. So, And then on the back here, we've got a couple of cute things. You've got this little menu that tells you about everything that's inside of this uh, little tray of sushi. Like I said, there's this... Um, uh, Oh goodness, I'm like having a hard time remembering words today. This is a special kind of thing that you might see uh, at, at sushi restaurants and also for a lot of times at the uh, grocery store if you buy obento and stuff. This is uh, rice, sushi rice, put inside of this kind of um, it's aburage. Uh, that's kind of what is put sometimes in miso soup. This becomes like a pocket, if you will, to put stuff inside. And what they've done is they've cleverly kind of made it look like a little Hello Kitty, which is pretty cute. These are really good. You dip these and season them into like a soy sauce and sugar base. So it's got a little hint of sweetness to it. 
uh, kids in, really like these. They're very tasty. And then you have the temaki sushi, which is like a rolled or wrapped sushi, uh, where you can even kind of make your own. And the top part, the face is made to look like Hello Kitty. And then this is like a, a roll, and it looks like maybe there's some like a shrimp or something in there. And um, it's meant to look like cherries, I think, with the little bit of nori on top. And then there's the uh, tamagoyaki, or fried egg sushi piece. This is fried egg that's fried with a little sweetness to it, too. And uh, a real staple and fun for little kids. And then the hashi, or the chopsticks. And the little fish full of soy sauce. Super cute. So, down here, we have this little bit of stuff here that you can cut out. Which is to put inside here to kind of keep some of the sushi from touching each other or being just straight on the ground, uh, on the ground, on the in the tray. So uh, if you've bought any bento or anything, you've seen these. They're just plastic usually, but this, of course, is cute because there's a little Hello Kitty on it. So we'll open everything up and see what we've got here. So first things, we've got this nice tray, and it's really adorable. You can see there's a little indentation of Hello Kitty's face inside there uh, to make it just a little bit even more perfect. Very cute little thing there. And then we have these um, chopsticks, and I was a little disappointed on these too because they don't come out. Um, I want them to come out <laughs> to be even more complete. The earlier Remint miniatures that were really popular about five years ago had more things, if you bought the really fancy ones, where things like this would actually come out and it would be even more elaborate and miniature. Um, this is kind of like a shortcut to that, but you know, maybe it's good, then you don't lose it. So, <laughs> And then we have the little rolled sushi there, with the cute Hello Kitty face on it. Adorable. Looks really very real. Very, very cute. And then here we've got that wrapped pocket of rice there. And I, to be honest, I don't know how they got the face on there. Uh, in real life, if you made this bento, I don't know how you do that. Maybe it's a stamping system of some kind. Um, it's brown, so it must be pre-made or something. So put that in here. And then the tamagoyaki. The ribbon is paper. It's a sticker. Uh, so you want to be careful if you have this set. You don't want to play with it too much. You can kind of see here. It's a strong sticker. And I don't think it's going to come off or break that easily. But uh, it is um, a sticker. So. And then this little roll sushi. Which I, it has like that processed... Uh, crab meat actually inside, not shrimp. And uh, then it has a little bit of seaweed at the top to make it look like the cherry that you might see for Hello Kitty. And then we also have the little fish. And I don't know if you guys can see this, I'm trying to show it. it has Hello Kitty right on the head part there. Can you see that little part? It's hard to show, isn't it? Maybe in the light you can kind of see it. So there's that little part to it too. And let's see if I can kind of try to... If I take my little thing here and try to copy the way it was set up. <laughs> you got your Maki here and this little guy up here. The Tom will go down here. So that you get something that looks like this, which is the whole complete set. And then you have the adorable little uh, chopsticks to go with it. So that's sort of the completed set for this particular version. And later on I'll try to show you guys everything all put together. Uh, but that's sort of uh, the finished little piece for this.